Now a story that's positively Milwaukee. A Grafton High School student with cerebral palsy isn't letting his wheelchair stop him from achieving his dreams. But dreams don't come without hard work and some help. Jesse Ricca reports. Students here at Grafton High School have put together a Formula First race car from scratch. They can go up to 40 miles an hour, but this year it wasn't about speed. Bryce Klug has loved race cars since he was little. So when he got to high school, he was instantly attracted to their Formula High School Motorsports program, where students design, create, and eventually drive a race car at Road America. And I kind of went and did a whole full body picture and I'm like, well, in there an uh, obvious obstacle. Confined to a wheelchair because of cerebral palsy, Bryce could have gotten discouraged, but his tech teacher, classmates, and cousin weren't going to let that happen. Bryce said he wanted to drive the car, so I just said, well, then you're going to drive the car. We just yeah. kind of brainstormed at lunch and came up with an idea. They used a rod to create a hand throttle That's and brake. Forward. Stop allowing Bryce to live his dream of racing at Elkhart Lake, an experience imprinted in his memory like tire tracks. Arm goes down, this goes forward, all I hear is forward. Bryce is the first student to ever use hand controls to compete in the Formula High School, so that was a pretty big thing, and then to have him improve every time he went out there on the track. But he's improving more than his race time. This has kind of helped him heal and kind of kind of think of himself as like he can do some stuff more than what he can think. All thanks to hard work and helping hands. I have all these guys to thank and if I had to pick a senior moment out of all my senior moments this would be the one right here thanks to dodging all these guys. And while the original goal of the program was to teach the students engineering, manufacturing and marketing skills, the students found that driving their efforts an extra mile made a huge difference. In Grafton, Jesse Ritka, today is TMJ4. Wow, Bryce plans to go to a technical college to pursue his passion for engines, motor and auto technology. Very impressive. I